friends, I am a very pissed off Mason right now. Sorry for the language. But, okay, let me adjust this without turning it off again by accident. That's what I did. Um, welcome back to me. It has been seven months. I literally just checked before I filmed, like, a five-minute segment. And it's been a hot minute, or, like, 20,000 since I have made a video. Seven months exactly. Uh, where have I been, you may ask? Uh, my health issues have taken over my life, and they had taken over my life before, but now it's like full grasp. Those issues deserve their own series, which will come eventually, but I needed to take a break for myself to, you know, just step back from the world and focus on myself, and I realized how much I missed everything pertaining to the beauty community and social media, talking about things, etc, etc. Along with it being a hot minute, I'm also a hot mess, so excuse me. <laughs> I'm really anxious about doing this video because I feel really socially inept. I don't get to talk to many people. Well, the conversation has been a little bit better since I've been like having more of a social media presence on my new account at Mason Lynn, which will be right here. Um, yeah, but I just, I missed this. I'm really excited to do this, which I think is also, also, excuse me, part of the anxiety. And I already talked about what today's video is and I opened up what it was and I was so excited. But um, anyway, I got my micro needling tool finally. Uh, this one's by Pure U Skin, which is P U R U Skin, and it's a derma roller with three attachments in three different levels. I'm gonna call them. This is an enhanced total body kit, and this is what it looks like. This is the top it came with which I believe is less than a millimeter, but it also came with one I know which is for under the eyes. So I'll have the opening up pleasure for this one if I can get it open. These are packaged like medical tools, which is very familiar to me. Okay, so here, this is the one that's for like fine areas like your eyes and your lips. And then, this one, I believe, this would be the 1.5 millimeter one, which is for larger areas of your body, e.g. your legs, your abdomen. I don't even know if you can do that, but it's not really opening, so I'm just going to show you that way. But we're only going to be using the one that came on the device today. An important thing, though, is that you have to cleanse these thoroughly. Like I'm meaning like at least 70% alcohol. I have 90%. You gotta wash your face. You gotta exfoliate with a gel or preferably a peel. And I have peel, which is my favorite thing right now. It's by Bosha and it's their exfoliating peel gel. Shout out Bosha. You like all my things on Instagram. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna take a quick I think like 15, 20 minute break and this will be clean. My face will be clean and my glasses will be off so no more glare and we'll be ready to go. All right guys, I have returned. I don't even know if I'm in frame or not. Okay, hopefully I'm in frame. So I'm back and I have a very floppy bun and my face is clean. My face has been peeled. And my derma roller has sat in the alcohol for about 20 minutes. So hopefully it's sterilized. <laughs> From what I've learned, you use a serum before and then you use a serum after. And today, where did I put it? I think it's back in my frequently used or currently used skincare bag. Uh, because this has retinol in it, and I read many places, heard many places that retinol is great to use before and after you do this. I'm using Sunday Riley's Luna Oil, 
it's technically a serum. So I'm gonna finally take my glasses off so there's no glare. I've actually just recently <laughs> gotten used to seeing myself without glasses. I mean, I really can't see see, but like in pictures and stuff, I'm like, oh, that's not that bad. Because for the longest time, I was just so self-conscious. I mean, I'm still pretty self-conscious, but um, yeah. I'm just going to rub this all over my face, even though I'm not going to be microneedling um, near my eyes or my lips just for today. Because um, I just want to give this a general um, go. Because I don't know how it's going to be for me. <laughs> so I'm also going to be using this mirror right here. This is my, oh my gosh, what is that mark mirror, I like to call it. Because it has a, a pretty big magnification. So with the derma roller, this is what I've learned to do. Even though I've never used it before, that's why we're here. So you go up and down side to side, and then in the X's. So I'm gonna start with up and down, and then side to side, X's, and then put more Luna on. And I will speed this portion up and talk about it afterward. <sighs> Why am I nervous? <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh! <laughs> It's like a tingly prickle. Oh, that one really tickled. I'm probably the only person in the world who's like, oh, my derma roller tickles me. But I'm just overly sensitive because of my health issues and whatnot and like having chronic pain and fibro. So, I mean, it like it's like pain, but not like pain I feel normally. But it, like, it's, like, it tickles. It feels like a tattoo almost. And I'm going very slow, not applying too much pressure at first, just so I can kind of get used to it. Maybe it'll help my wrinkles. I'm getting premature wrinkles. It's a lovely, lovely feeling. Okay, side to side. Oh, I forgot to do my nose. Do my nose just a little bit. Because my nose it gets very... That's it. <laughs> Sorry, you now hear my dad vacuuming or redoing our bathroom. I mean, if you look super closely, you can kind of see very minuscule puncture marks. Now, it says don't use it if you have rosacea. I technically don't have rosacea. It's just when my pain flares, my face gets red. But it's not categorized as rosacea. But anyway, I digress. Um, I'm going to get a little closer. This is as close as I can get without making everything fall. Um, my face, I don't know, kind of feels rejuvenated in a sense. Um, it didn't really hurt too too bad um like you saw i <laughs> was giggling because it kind of tickled me i don't exactly know why but we'll roll roll, <laughs> roll with it so i'm gonna put luna on again by sunday riley because it has retinol and i'm just gonna lightly pat it this time and then gently swish it upwards and I didn't do my nose really today but we'll get there okay overall I think this is something I'm going to keep doing in my beauty regimen um there's different recommendations for the different needle sizes and how your skin tolerates it so I'm gonna give it a week and then I'll eventually move on to eye and lip treatments, but I just want to see how my skin performs over the next week or so. But other than that, I, I actually liked it. It wasn't painful in the sense of my kind of pain, but I also have a very high pain tolerance because, I mean, I want pain patches and 
<sighs> I still have pain. But um, yeah, I liked it. So if you have any questions, I'm not an expert, but I could point you in the right direction. Uh, ask me below, find me on Instagram, which I'll put right here again. And hopefully I'll be making more videos soon. -ish. I'm hoping in maybe tomorrow I'll make another video. But anyway, thanks guys for watching. I really appreciate it and thanks for waiting this long and thanks for the subscribers who subscribed during my hiatus. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe, comment, find me on Instagram. I'll link my Twitter again at some point. But yeah, that's it for today guys. Bye, thanks.